guys, my boy, God damn it, I'm bringing you a new mother freaking, wait a minute, this is a coin game. Not necessarily a regular gameplay, it's a commentary, this is a coin game, versus my friend, uh, Jay, also known as Two Nights, most of you may know him, he is a YouTuber, his YouTube link will be in the description below, this is just a 20k coin game, right now, I'm getting the ball first, I'm just wanna, I just wanna really just get my feet wet, and basically see what he likes to play with, cause I played him earlier this year, and he won, I think it was, 9 to 14 or something like that or maybe 10 to 14 he beat me by a couple points it was earlier this year it was only for 10k i'm starting off my coin games relatively small i plan to work my way up right now i'm just driving the ball just taking it nice and slow third and go at the goal line i thought i make a very bad read kind of baited me into that he gets the interception i was kind of frustrated so right now i just basically just wasted four minutes for nothing i didn't come out with any points now he has the ball he just ran the ball. I'm just trying to also see what he likes to do on offense, just so I can get a feel from my opponent on what they like to do in uh, certain situations like that. Now, most of you guys may know that Two Nights has a pretty good team. He has a very, very well balanced team, and his 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 players are probably around the same caliber as mine, I guess. Maybe a little better. I believe he is the 88. Also, I'm not 100% sure. Don't quote me on that. But he makes a, a, a kind of a bad read. I wish, I really, 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 really wish my players, instead of just always swatting the ball down, will actually finally pick up a brain and catch the ball. Right now, I get the interception with a keep to leave, and we're back first and 10 running the ball with the Marco Murray. About negative two yard loss. So right here, I, I make another bad read, and I guess EA bailed me out again. So I must admit, a couple times this game, I did make a couple bad reads, and versus good players, you really cannot make bad reads too, too, uh, too much. I see I get a nice little lane with Demarco. I maybe should have probably duked to the outside. I may have been a touchdown. But anyways, next play, it doesn't matter. Touchdown! And <clears throat> but if you guys will notice in this video, every time I score a touchdown or just any of my videos, period, I always have to dive into the end zone. Just because of the fact, I don't know, it just makes me, it just brings like a more excitement to the game. I don't dive in the end zone to be any uh, any type of disrespectful, especially not to uh, too nice or anything. I have the I have, I have the utmost respect for him. He's a pretty cool guy. He's helped me uh, with some stuff involving Mutt. So I wouldn't just taunt him like that or anything. But anyways, back to the gameplay. Second and 12, I hit the pass to Josh Gordon. A little play action crossing route. I noticed that I basically noticed the stuff that he was running, so I started making slight adjustments to out to what he was doing. Now I'm trying to get an end zone. First and ten, I have to go ahead, Jordan Cameron, the crossing route. And at first, and I'm at the one yard line, so you know what I'm about to do QB sneak, Andrew Luckin. So at the end of the second quarter, I'm currently up 14 0. I'm pretty, and I'm feeling really good. Once again, this isn't too much of a, a big coin game, just 20k. But next time I play him, I think, depending on how much coins I have, I will have to save a look at that. Clay Matthews. I started from the D-line, came all the way back because I saw the route open, and I just met him at the time to do the pass. It was a very good play by me. Now, here I got all types of day, and I just make a, I should have probably just ran that. Instead of trying to force something, tried to lead the pass down, I was going to try to use it, catch that. It didn't really work out in my favor. Here, I get a little pressure. I don't know how. But I wasn't no, it wasn't no type of blitz. It was just a regular, a regular play. And he just destroyed his offensive lineman. But hey, I'm not complaining. Do what you do. You know what I'm saying? And another play, and I was getting all kinds of interceptions today in this gameplay. Asante Samuel. It's not the flashback. Don't be so, guys. Calm down. It's just a regular goal. Asante Samuel. I think he's like an 83 overall. Give the ball back to the Marco, Marco Polo, Marco Polo. Anyways, I'm up currently 21 to zero, and at the middle, at the halfway point of the third quarter. So you guys know I'm feeling real, I'm feeling smooth and groovy. But he's he's also starting to drive the ball. This game is far from over, especially with the quarters that five minutes long. This game is far from over. So right here, he's driving the ball. 58 seconds left in the third quarter. He looks to go deep. I got Rogers Camardi over there. Our boys know how to use them feet. Man, he, man, he pretty fast. Man, he pretty fast. I think, yeah, this, this is a goal, Dominic Rodgers. Come on. That should have been an interception if my linebacker turned around and his tight end. I think that's Dave Casper. Just gets loose. I try to spam A. Try to get that suction tackle. And it would just went and give me the link. The Marco Murray. That should have been another touchdown. I keep getting these, these very, very close big runs. But I'll take 10 yards of pop all game. I'll just feed the horse. And back again across the middle to Jordan Cameron. I, I basically read his defense so I knew what 
I could call that would work and what I didn't and right there I throw at his neck get a nice little user catch with Jordan Cameron similar to the play I did about 10 plays ago where I threw the interception right now it's 21 to 7 I'm just trying to basically run out the clock in this game on a nice friendly note he had an ice out route had to make some big throw down the conversions and there goes me diving the end zone again once again it's not disrespect it's just something I just like to do it makes it a little more exciting well that's the game Thanks for a very good opponent from two nights and hey, let's get fucking that.